Hey guys, welcome back, and today there's some, uh, news for us to talk about today. I think the first story I want to talk about today with you guys is a very crazy one. So, uh, Olex went ahead and posted something over on Twitter that is just so mind-blowing that I cannot believe this actually happened. So, Olex got a warning for apparently directing users off of platform, but you can see here, it's, it's just a Roblox link. How, how is it off platform? <laughs> Bro, it is so crazy. I don't even know how this stuff is happening anymore because I obviously myself get warnings like this because wh wh what's going on here is it's like mass reporting it, it, uh, Roblox doesn't even look at the moderations they're doing they just probably get a ton of reports and then they're like oh something is going on here so we're just gonna remove whatever but it's like do they even like look at the moderations does any human look at these because uh <laughs> directing users off platform and by the way as well uh he is a star creator so uh, th there's like zero protection for star creators, which is also kind of wild. But uh, yeah, d that is apparently uh, a ban against Roblox. You cannot post Roblox links because it's directing people off of Roblox, but it's literally on Roblox. I have no idea. But I want to get on to the next story of today, which is kind of cool, kind of an interesting one. So Bloxburg, as you guys might have known, it was recently sold, uh, I think it was to the same people who made Satisfactory Coffee Stain Studios. I think the very first update that Bloxburg Bloxburg has received since being acquired for I think it was a hundred million dollars is coming out and it actually looks to be a pretty decent update here uh, I guess they are adding a gym I probably got some videos or something on screen right now that you can look at and uh, it looks overall like really interesting like I I'm very excited to see what this will be and uh, I mean just the quality of this as well it looks really good because from what I know Bloxburg had, was a very very small team before but uh, now you can see like like these are like mo capped animations of people you know doing gym stuff which is really really cool so uh, we'll have to see what happens with this and I'm very excited uh, because Blacksburg is honestly one of my favorite games and like we'll have to see what happens with that but uh, I will say I'm very excited and it definitely looks very very cool now um the next story I want to talk about with you guys was a video by mr. green Lego cats himself the video was about Lisa gaming now I don't need to give any explanation on who who Lisa Gaming is, because uh, uh, she's pretty infamous in the community, but uh, it, it, this video was pretty uh, interesting, and it talked about how, like, Lisa Gaming, uh, for one, is actually, like, a really bad person, apparently, behind the scenes, which I didn't really have any idea of. I've kind of, like, heard different things, but I didn't really know, like, fully, like, what was going on. So, yeah, I, I guess she's a really horrible person or something. But, uh, yeah, so Lisa Gaming, she's done a lot of bad stuff uh, on her career i guess as a youtuber uh the thing that i remember first hearing her for was the blocksburg house griefing stuff and uh yeah that that was like really messed up i i feel like that at no explanation that it was pretty messed up of her but uh yeah i i the video pretty much talked about how a lot of the people that are currently giving her attention are literally just fans of her and it's like so true i remember laughability did a video like really recently talking about this too and uh yeah like if if you want to make a person like that go away do not subscribe to their channel or comment on every one of their videos i mean like it's really funny because they're quite literally boosting themselves in the algorithm and, and same with like people like creecraft and all of that like actually like contributing to like you know the the whole drama or whatever like you're, you're indirectly giving her attention i mean like this is something that i kind of realized with the whole uwu cute single stuff because uh she, she just sort of like actually like like, started using the attention people were giving her as a way to make, like, bait troll videos. And, uh, yeah, that, that happened when, in reality, she was doing something, like, entirely messed up, where she was promoting a gambling site to children, which was just crazy. But something funny that happened to both UUQ Single and Lisa Gaming was they both got banned off of Roblox recently, which is, like, absolutely hilarious. But Lisa Gaming has kind of, like, disappeared. She hasn't made videos in a long time. And, uh, honestly, no one really cares about her anymore, which is also kind of funny but uh, it really shows that that sort of content you can really only go so far with uh because i mean you could only really do so
so much until people just don't care and that that's pretty much like the entirety of their content is people caring and uh people don't care well people don't watch and when people don't watch uh they just become irrelevant i mean there's a lot of other clout chasers who've tried to do stuff like what lisa gaming has done and uwu cute single but uh, no one just talked about them so you don't hear about them that's why you don't know of them if you see people like this a really good thing to do is just uh ignore them that that is the best thing you can do don't watch their videos just ignore them but uh like i said though before apparently lisa gaming is a really bad person behind the scenes uh green lego cats pr put some stuff in his video i had no idea about any of this stuff i just thought she was just some troll trying to get attention online but it looks like she's actually done some things that are pretty illegal and horrible including doxing and things i just can't mention on youtube but uh yeah i'm not really all that shocked but still it, it just you have to remember with people like this because this isn't just something with like roblox it's just something in general with like you know the internet the the best thing you could do to trolls online is give them no attention i i swear i especially see this stuff like on twitter and stuff like that of like people just saying like outrageous things and then you have like a hundred different people you know feeding into that i mean an example recently right uh i mean i'm gonna be real i was kind of the little troll here right uh elon musk made a post on twitter i replied if he becomes the ceo of twitter i'm moving to tanzania now uh that post got over 300 replies and uh like it's just mind-blowing people actually thought that was real i mean i probably have it on screen and it looks so fake but uh there are people who really will fall for anything and uh the people who are falling for it especially on the lisa gaming videos it's like they they're fans i'm sorry they are if you are commenting subscribing and disliking every one of her videos uh you, you are a fan of lisa gaming like you are just helping her in the algorithm pretty funny stuff all around but gamers i want to get on to the next and final story of today and uh this last story is something kind of funny i saw over on twitter and i don't really know how this stuff works so i'll have someone like I, a better explanation on this but i saw this on twitter uh this is apparently if you remove the chat filter from game you can say these unicodes and i have no idea how this is being done but you can see right here he's actually saying uh the roblox a uh, roblox premium sign he's saying the robux sign and he's saying the verified check mark sign and now i'm gonna be willing to guess that you could probably say more than just that like probably like the star creator one and just like a lot of different ones but like <laughs> dude is roblox adding emojis wait what like how, how does that work i'm so confused the chat filter wouldn't that just break roblox chat i mean to be fair i remember seeing like people like making games where you could like swear on roblox so maybe that's what he's talking about i don't know entirely how this is being done but uh i'd really like a better explanation on this because that is very weird and uh maybe roblox is adding emojis who knows i mean they already have emojis but like i don't know it, it, like custom things i don't know but yeah that's pretty much been all of the news happening in the roblox community for the last day if you guys like today's video make sure to let me know down down below and tell me your thoughts on everything we talked about and this person here is cool because they follow me on twitter but anyways gamers i'm gonna go ahead and end today's video here see you guys